Hmm. Looking at this question, this is a polynomial question. Polynomials are expressions with ascending or descending orders of powers. So this polynomials has a power of 3. The highest power is 3. So therefore, we can say that the polynomial is of degree 3. And another thing about this polynomial or this question is that it has to do with factor and remainder. What does factor and remainder mean? If I'm giving this polynomial, for example, I say x squared plus 2x plus 4 divided by s plus 1. To divide this polynomial, I will simply use long division method to say that s squared plus 2s plus 4, then here will be s plus 1. After solving, I will get a remainder here. And the value I will get here is the quotient. For more of this, you can check out my uh, polynomial videos where I solved long division questions under polynomials. I will share the link to that below also in case you need to check that out. You have this. Now, this is the remainder. Remainder can either be a whole number. It can also be zero. If you solve a polynomial and the remainder is equals zero, this implies that this guy that is dividing is a factor of this polynomial. Transferring the knowledge to this question, this question says this is a factor of this polynomial. This implies that if we use this guy to divide this, the remainder would be zero. In that case, since s plus 1 is a factor, equals, s plus 1 is equal to zero, it means s is equal to minus 1. Substituting s as minus 1 into this polynomial, our answer should be zero. So we come here and say that s raised to the power of 3 plus 3s square plus ks plus 4. If f, f is equal to minus 1, then we have minus 1 raised to the power of 3 plus 3 minus 1 square plus k minus 1 plus 4 equals 0. So that is that. So anytime you are giving this type of question, you are usually asked for two things. Either you are asked to find the remainder or one of the values will be given and you are asked to look for it. If you are asked to look for the remainder in this polynomial and here is not k, here is just s, all you just need to do is substitute s equals minus 1 in the polynomial. That is how you find the remainder. So these type of questions are very popular. So now we have this. Minus 1 raised to the power of 3 is minus 1. Plus minus 1 squared is 1. 1 times 3 is 3. Minus k plus 4 is equals 0. Minus 1 plus 3 is 2. 2 plus 4 is 6. So we have 6 minus k is equals 0. C is equals k and k is equals 6. So the value of k is simply 6. So that's the answer to that polynomial question. Thank you for watching my video. I am Flash Isaac. Feel free to subscribe to this channel, Flash Learners, to get my updates on new videos. And don't forget to check out my other videos. Visit flashlearners.com slash videos or search Flash Learners on YouTube to see my amazing videos for all your topics. I really appreciate your time. Thank you. <laughs>